want the guests to walk into a unbelievable fantasy environment that they've never ever seen. Every single thing will be rethought of from the floor to the facade to the smells within the environment to the lighting and even the bar. Everything is going to just be rethought and redone. So they're going to walk in and they're not going to forget it. We've decided to expand our net and throw it out further and activate the window display. Each night we have a different performer. For example, we have a sword swallower tonight, we have jugglers, and we are using that window as an advertisement to garner more interest in the space. Even though it's painted by several amazing artists, it looks like it has the feeling of being painted by one group or one individual. A project like this, communication is really important because if you have a great idea, it's pointless unless you can properly convey it to all the different people working on it. Like one person is sculpting the tree, then another person is going to be painting it, then it has to interact nicely with the wall that someone else makes. So if there's not a clear vision, then it doesn't fit together at all because there's a lot of different aspects to the space with the styling and the painting and the props and the sculpting. With Adam helping kind of define more clearly what the vision is and the purpose. to the Hendrix Enchanted Forest of Curiosities. I liked the creativity about it, the mossy feel that was more of a southern style. Walk into a tree and become a tree for a photo booth. They could interact, they could do all that kind of stuff. I want them not only to enjoy the artist's performance, but realize that the space is an artist itself.